What is going on, subscribers? Welcome back to the Pumpkin Dylan channel. Today we are doing a drop off to one of our construction sites. We are on the pallet or the warehouse series. We have a curtain uh, trailer here, so these sides can go. We have these saber barriers. We're not getting caught on the rails here. We gotta deliver them to the job site. Uh, if you've seen by Walmart, the new internet company is hard at work called MetroNet. Need to be safer barriers because they're gonna be underground. They wanna keep them away from the traffic. We're gonna drop them off. We got the forklift off the back, strap down. I think I've used this trailer in the past. There's been different versions out there. Of links down in the description below. It's from the uh, TLC, I believe. If I'm getting that name right. Um, any further stuff, don't use the Mod Hub links because they have that stupid downloading website that only you only download one per like two hours or so. So that's kind of kind of strange. So I just go to a, another farming website and grab them. So here's our drop off. We'll pull onto our mess of Walmart here. We'll get back on the road and then just drop off from there. I think we'll go right here. our flashers on give us enough space and then we press in you just have to cycle actually we'll do it on this side this side will be a lot safer instead of the road side actually on, don't get stuck Getting stuck by weird ass collisions. Let's get a quick screenshot. Take off the strap. And if you use the um, four wheel drive, I think it's like Hanson mod need to activate four-wheel drive so that this thing will actually move. All I do is go through one of the pallets and then go up the middle of the safer barrier. That usually holds it pretty steady. go. Sometimes the collisions will bug out and your forks will go through the pallets, but you just have to reset. I think we'll just deliver right here. Let's go up to here. There you go. Got that mirror that actually works.
get up there and actually tug it this way. So after yesterday's release of Durham Max Nation, you probably guys remember him, he used to be a YouTuber, and he finally released this whole Chevy thing that was like 30 some dollars on his Patreon. Finally got released so I can finally do my Patreon video that one. I didn't want to do it and basically comparing them. So obviously we could do custom modding which is uh, right here. Very awesome Patreon. Do Lambo mods and then Duramax Nation. I think of any others, we'll throw them in. So look out for that video, and we can do a comparison, and we'll see who's the better one. I think between custom modding and uh, Lambo mods, it's going to be a pretty tight race. I would have to say myself. Oh, we can do wood metal farms too. I would have to say Wood Metal Farms has been better than they were in 20... I have to, I have to look at my membership, but I think it was like 2016. 2016 or 2017 when they first started. They were only releasing one mod a month, but you could also say that was them getting started. Now they're way better today. There we go. Sometimes these pallets can be a little tricky. That's what we're literally grabbing nothing. And if this is the first video you guys are viewing on the channel, hope you guys stick around and subscribe. If you guys haven't seen the videos for a while, we are now doing 5M. So, if you guys don't know what 5M is, it's pretty much a role-playing series uh, servers on GTA 5. If you're familiar with ATS, it's you literally go to 5M.com and it's literally like just going to TruckerMP.com and downloading their application very easy so we got some really cool um, cool boxes here on the back so this one's not locked down by that strap sometimes if it's close to a strap it will be locked down so what this trailer is going to enable us is to be able to do, um, you know, dropping things off from the warehouse. I think we can still use the white one, they just have to have a ramp or a loading dock. Get out of these stupid collisions. I think this thing up 
sidewalk. It's just how these maps are produced. There is a big collision for some odd reason coming out of the trailer. People need to get their damn collisions right. Yeah, and I fall into a collision. It's got to be from the sidewalk. Now it's fine out here. Unfuck. Sometimes these straps are pretty tricky. Well, I guess the construction site will get a toolbox. Not the end of the world. I'll just add it to their order list. And it's an actual working toolbox also. Alright, let's head back to the warehouse. this on the back of the trailer. Yeah, I can see the collisions. Jesus. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope you guys stick around for some other videos. Hope you guys have a awesome Thanksgiving if you guys haven't already shared your plans from the first video which was the 2020 snow plowing vid um, be interesting to know let me know your Thanksgiving plans if you guys do anything fun I know when I was at at least in school, not, or I guess college too. We had just, basically we had to go Monday and Tuesday. All right, we'll have to go turn around. With that, guys, have a great day. Enjoy all the videos. Um, I went through the list in the 2020 snow plowing vid. We got more uh, 5M stuff coming out. We're going to be using all the production mods. We're going to start to use them. We'll do the Pepsi factory. Uh, just depends how much time I have. And hope you guys enjoy your day. Thank you for coming every time and watching my videos thanks for all the likes thanks for the positive feedback on the 5m seems like you guys are really enjoying it we're going to be trying all the jobs out uh we'll probably i tried the bus the other night uh went pretty good um well we'll make content with that game i'll try to find some other 5m servers if you have a 5m server let me know in the comments below i had one guy that wanted to play with me definitely get in touch and we'll do some 5M. If you guys want to, uh, hop in the Discord, which is now down in the description permanently. 
every video from now on so that's where I'm going to be active uh, you won't see me in a group or one of the chats on, or one of the channels on my actual channel but look in the right hand corner on the discord and you'll see me if I'm online or not thank you guys see you guys